Hello everybody, my name is Katimar. Welcome back for another video of Life is Strange 2. We're gonna continue this, boys. We're right where we last left off. I had to redo the entire scene right here. Uh, so here we go. We're gonna take uh, the tool he's gonna give us. Uh, Daniel's gonna give us. We're stuck right now. We're trying to destroy the pipe or something. There we go. So that should be enough to tear out the pipe. Come on. Let's it's gonna this. make a lot of noise if we're not careful. All right, come on. Tear it off. I'm I'm smashing the hell out of that. Yes. There we go. Good job, bro. All right, I'm free. Or no, the pipe is. Uh, I'm I'm not free, but the pipe is. Uh, there go. I can actually move. So the pipe is. Uh, the thing that was uh, prevented me from moving is uh, is not there anymore. So I can actually get the keys now. I think. Reach for the keys. Come on, you mother. There we go. Got it. Got the keys. Get them. Uh, get them here right now. Pick it up. All right. So we got the keys. We're gonna get out of here. Here, here. Come on. All right, let's go. Charlotte. Quick. Oh god. I was so scared. You have time to hug me. Just free me already. What happened to your That doesn't matter. Let's go. We got to go, man. We need to cut this off fast. It's not going to be good, boys. It's not, we're not going to end up good on this. There we go. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. What? Where did he go? Why did she? Daniel? What? What happened? Sean? Or uh, Daniel? What did you do? I don't know. Why would you even go there? I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. So we can either steal or leave. Still the camping gear for sure, man. We're stealing everything. We're stealing everything, boys. I mean, uh, might as well. Uh, you fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to. Might as well uh, do it, right? The hell with you. Okay, so what do we have here? Run or knock the uh, knock out and steal. I'm not gonna knock him out and steal. I told you. Sean, what are you doing? Yeah, Daniel, come on. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Come on. Uh, wait. Shit. I don't even know why Daniel would even try to go from the front door. We, You came from the back door. Go back to the back door, you dumb. Uh, whatever. Sean. He's a kid, I guess. Over there. Let's go. I don't know. Oh, there's this dude right here. Maybe he's gonna help us. You guys okay? We're not. That asshole at the gas station. We're fucking crazy. He tied me up in his back office. I swear. Dude. Say no more. I believe you. Okay. It's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us. Let's go. We're out of here. We're lucky to have someone that's really cool, boys. To have encountered someone that probably helped us. If we haven't, I didn't talk to him, boys. We probably didn't have to talk to him. I'm not sure, boys, but. Maybe there's an option where you, if you hadn't talked to him, uh, you couldn't have drove away with him. I don't know, boys. That would have been insane. Shit's crazy, boys. Hopefully, uh, we'll be fine now. You already know it's not gonna happen, but hopefully this guy is absolutely okay, you know? Because he does look at naked picture. I don't know, boys. 
Seems pretty fishy to me. Uh, why did he freak out on us? Did he did he mess with you? No, I'm gonna see. He was a total fucking dickhead. Man, it felt good to beat his ass. Whoa, kid. Maybe he deserved it, but don't do it and don't talk about it. You know what I'm saying? Sorry. I'm just still pissed off. Welcome to Redneck Land. That ain't Seattle no more. Uh, more big foes than Mexicans. Only lived in one place. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kind of lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. Uh, What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. Uh, what did you hide? Uh, the puppy, are you s What? what? The saved her. <laughs> We're heroes. We're not heroes if she if he dies or she dies. Oh my god. We can't keep a dog. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But uh, we couldn't leave her with those meat. At least she they can feed her, That's not the us. Please on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We need we don't need a dog if we can't feed her. Just stop. God damn it. You win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. Don't give her any like bad like stuff. She's gonna die. And what should we name her? Uh, she's pretty like hey, sure. Your dog. It's a dog, sure. It's cool and all. Let's see. But you gotta feed her. You gotta uh Take care of the uh, the shit she puts in every day every Not time. Sure. Are you ready for that? Really Not now? Sure. Oh, pretty cool, I guess. Yeah. I'll say cool. far uh, <laughs> whatever her name wants Girl's you name to. Do. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right, mushroom it is then. Mushroom is a <laughs> terrible name. Yeah. But whatever. Brother. See, mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. Yeah, well, I'm not sure how I feel about the whole dog situation, though. <laughs> We're gonna end up killing the dog because we have to take care of it and we don't have the resources to do it. And all these cops around with us as well, around us, you know. It's not gonna happen. What do you do exactly on the road for a long time? Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. All right. That's pretty cool. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, how do you make money? How are you? Fa are you famous? Ever get lonely? I'm not gonna say that. Uh, how do you make? No. Are you famous or something? Are you like famous or something? <laughs> More like or something. Okay. So it's kind of my, my he's kind of my region a little no bit, am, right? Not famous at all, but he's getting good for it. It's getting pretty, pretty good. Awesome. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous too. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, uh, I'd be like my family. Uh, End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. 
Seriously. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. I don't know about this. You should stay away. You know, have uh, shifts and stuff. Because you don't know what this guy's going to do. He's fine and all. I'm telling you, he looked at naked picture. You you can't just say that and, uh, and say all of a sudden, oh, it's cool. He, he's cool. That's not how it goes, man. Come on, Sean. Get your shit together. You need to stay awake. Don't go asleep. Don't go sleeping on him now. North Oregon coast. Three hours later. All right, so. I think we are good so far until we actually arrive at a safe place or something and we there's nothing bad happening to us and this guy is not actually um, a weirdo I'll say that he's cool but until then I'm on the edges boys We're all a goddamn redneck on our heads we don't need a pervert that's for sure I'm not saying he's one but you never know At least he lets us sleep. So, for, so far, so good. Oh, we just had to uh, take a piss, huh? All right. Man, look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. I think this is the... I think this is uh, this is it, boys. This is the city, right there, Arcadia Bay. I think it is, boys. Listen. If it is, if it is the case, we might see Max. That should be really cool. Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I, I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. My fucking fault. It was the police, for sure. It was the police. It's their fault. Daniel just wanted to play zombie outside. Your shithead neighbor was picking on him. And I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... <laughs> fucking cops. Hey, it's gonna be all right. Take a deep breath. This is not good, boys. Well, if you're right, because I recognize the fort and everything, so listen. That's why I'm saying I'm it's really probably uh, Arcadia Bay. It probably is, you know. The way it, it looks, the lands and everything. Everywhere. And you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. How? No? How am I gonna be okay? How? Wish I could go back to my town. Even if it was boring like that one. At least I've had friends, family, a home. I used to bitch about it so much. Now I've got nothing. What is sure is that's the past, but you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. 
I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. Yeah, that's for sure. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. It's my duty as an ad like time. mere adult. I, I gotta tell Take him. You know, I'm the, the adult in there. It, the better. I'm the one taking care of him. I'm gonna need like I can't keep him I'm in the secrets and stuff. It's just It's not gonna be easy. It's never easy. That's part of it. So then what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking get out of the country fuck it go down to mexico you know mexico don't go to mexico go in canada my dude you'll be safe there why does everybody want to go all like why does in every game and goddamn shows everybody wants to go to mexico and not canada what's so wrong about canada boys might be colder at a, in the winter but uh, it's 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 pretty hot, and I'm telling you, way hotter than in the U.S. when it's uh, an actual um, uh, not winter, like spring and um, how do you fucking call it? Anyways, like it's way hotter. So I don't know what's wrong with Canada, man. Why do fucking the Americans don't want to go there for some reason? I don't get it. Should I go back? Should we keep going? Should we keep going? Maybe this is crazy, but should we just keep going till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes, this is exactly what you're supposed to do. At the same time, they are on Oregon, so I think Oregon is in the south of the U.S., so might make a little bit more sense that they want to go to Mexico. It's way uh, like what about your less far than like. No. Canada is way farther than Mexico at that point, but out of the picture. still much better safe place than Dad, Mexico. God damn. That's a pretty cool name. So it's got to be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. All right, let's go. Uh, let's hit the road back, boys. We're going to Mexico, I guess. Not really, because there we go. There's a little Easter egg. There's Arcadia Bay right there. I'll drop you by. Is that it? Is that I'll just gonna be it? Just a little Easter egg right there. We're not actually gonna go there. Pacific Harbor, Oregon. All right, we're still there. Uh, two hours later, so we are way past. I imagine. Way past Arcadia Bay or, or still close to it? I don't know, boys. I really doubt we're gonna go there, though. Really doubt it, boys. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I wasn't... Uh, wait. Is that the su two seals or whatever? Okay, no, it's just a motel. I thought it was the restaurant from Arcadia Bay. I really want them to go to th over there, boys. I... I just want the the entire series to come to a close, boys. Really, like, get every character to see each other and stuff. That would be pretty nice. I have the goddamn crossover already. Well, what about the sticks? No, I'm not gonna... Sand ca castle? Too bad sand castles never last. Alright, what about... I guess this, play fetch. Hey, let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay, but I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Not in the water, please. Uh, let's go over... Over there. Come on, Mushroom. Right there. It's not too far. It's not going to be out of danger. It's right here. Wait, where is he going? I didn't throw it there. Oh my god, we're gonna lose the puppy now. I told you! Oh no, he's right there. Alright, never mind. You're fine, buddy. I didn't say anything. God damn it. I'm just ready that. What did you find? What is this? 
What happened? Oh. You just killed a shark. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. All right, we've got a, a, a nice souvenir right there. Uh, give that. Yeah, sure, give him to him. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast will get the stick. You go for it. It's a nice little thing right there. You just throw it and I swear, you get something. I Come on, mushroom. Something tells me he's gonna fucking throw it in the water and mushroom's gonna die. I know mushroom's gonna die, boys. I have a feeling you can't get a dog and he can't die. Like, it's just impossible for him to survive this journey. Impossible. Come on, mushroom. Get that stick. Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And... Some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay? But you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Okay, I'll get rid of it, sure. You yeah, get a burner. because they can probably trace me, so for sure I need to get all of it, rid of it. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Brody, to. You're not leaving. Of Are course he's leaving. He can't keep. But he can't just stay with us forever. Brody, I understand, man. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho ho ho! And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody. Feels good. Here, looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's... Your bandana now. Pretty nice, pretty cool. Okay. Time for me to hit the road. Yeah, alright, he's ready. Ready to go. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, a tribe called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. This guy is really cool, boys. <laughs> the really cool dude, really cool dude. He bought you, he bought Wish you could stay with like a night for us. Too, really cool. So unfortunately, I can't stay any longer. Hey, it's I'll really. Probably he's not a pervert, boys. Look at this. So actually, someone. He's probably Canadian, boys. He's probably Canadian. I'm telling you right now. Uh, he's way too. I'm gonna miss him. He's way too good with us. He's probably Canadian. That's for sure. He's not from the U.S. I love it, though. I love him. Okay. Pretty nice guy. Time to hit the sack. Going to the motel. Have a nice uh, night of sleep. Don't worry, mushroom. I got you. Dogs are not permitted in motels, though. So what are you gonna do about mushroom? I'm telling you, it's not gonna work. Oh my God. Okay. I'm gonna keep saying it until something happens to actually if something happens to mushroom boys. I'm gonna and when it happens, I'm gonna say to, to tell him, I told you, you know. Do you think it will have Netflix? Uh, no, it won't have Netflix because they don't pay for that, and there's no jacuzzis in motels, my guy. Have cable and a hot shower. Uh, where is even our motel right now? Like, it's he said room ten. Oh, it's in here. That's nine. So it's this one right here. All right. Here's our room. It's only one night, dude. So don't be so happy about it, you know. We're crashing for the night, and afterwards we gotta camp again. 
good. We, we don't have any money. You in, cave boy. We can watch TV too. And there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice and warm. Can I actually charge my phone? Which, by the way, instead of charging my phone, I should probably just throw it like uh, oh. the, the other dude said. What about this one? Uh, not bad. But too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Do whatever you want. Wanna play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, but Ready? I am so ready to beat you. Papers, scissors. Yeah, I knew it. I got him. Shoot. I told you, man. <coughs> Wanna play another round? Come on. Uh, a deal's a deal, man. Hey, a deal's a deal. Too late. Sorry, little bro. Too late for that. Gotta accept Aww. it. Okay. Don't start pouting. Come on. I'm not. All right. I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, pig pen. I wouldn't be so sure, cave boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. All right. Um, handwriting note. What is this? Oh, shit, that was wild. Oh yeah, we stole that. We have a tent now. At least we have a tent. We got something. Is it all right? I, that's not what I want to look at. I want to look at the... There we go. The note. Thanks for everything, Brody. That's a long ass note. I'm better writer. Okay, so it's for us. You can, you guys can read that. Right? I know I skipped it pretty fast, but you can pause the uh, video and read it. Man. Wish we still had Brody around. Oh, it's Brody's name. All right. Well, I can't there be there forever. So here's our bag. AFK. All right. Interesting. We still, we actually have more money. He actually did gave us money, boys. So we got thirty-five dollars. Uh, nice, nice. All right. Anything else? Hi, son. All right. Got plenty of stuff right here, as you can see. That's pretty cool. All right. Uh, what about this? All right. So we came all the way from here, boys, and all the sudden we're in here, right there. That's a, a really big trip. And you can see Arcadia Bay is right along, oh, in the middle right there. You, you actually see the forts. All right. So we got two, uh, two stuff right here. Interesting. I'm gonna buy aware of this, I guess. Can I? Huh? How do I toggle sidebar? How do I equip it? Oh, I, whatever, boys. Um, what else do we got here? We got a card. Yeah. Free eyes, free we'll Wi-Fi, of course. Even though the Wi-Fi is gonna be pretty shit, you already know, boys. Uh, iron. I tried to iron my shirts once. Burned a hole through them. A tie. Huh? Who lives it? Who leaves a tie in here, boys? I don't know. All right, let's just um, just to go to the bathroom, I guess. Turn on. There you go. Uh, motel rules. I gotta really read that because it's important. No worries. We don't have to build a fire tonight. But we can get dogs. In man, in motels you don't have the rights to have dogs. I don't know, boys. Uh, unless it's different in the US, I really doubt it. Bubble bath. Time to be a kid again. Really? Okay, if you say so. Uh, he's gonna actually take a bath? I don't know about that. I'm all about showers, boys. Baths are not my thing at all. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to wait for the water to... Uh, to, to do its stuff, I guess. Uh, toiletries. Now add soap. I'm gonna have a, a goddamn bubble bath. My guy. You kid or something? I don't know. I'm telling you boys, I'm all about showers. Showers is the best thing ever. I don't know about baths. Baths are not really that good. 
I'll feel secure in baths. A climb up, a uh, clean up. All right. I'm gonna guess I can <sighs> clean myself up. I guess. That fucking redneck hit me hard. Isn't that what a bath is for, though? I don't get it. I really don't, boys. Really strange. Oh, I think it's ready. Hang on. Is it ready? Hey, Daniel. Bath's ready. What? Already? Can I finish? Oh, it's for Daniel, huh? No, man. He smells it's not so for bad. me? There's All right. To lose. So I guess the bath is for him. What? Where are you going with the, with the puppy now? Don't go drowning him. Oh my god. Whoa. So many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. And no, the dog is not taking the yeah. with you. Okay, okay. Not happening. Yeah, don't worry. And you you say that as you go with him in the bathroom. Throw my phone away while okay, I don't like this, boys. He's gonna drown the goddamn puppy. Alright, take the phone, charging phone. I'm gonna let it charge. Um, Daniel's shoes. What is all this? Daniel's backpack, old toy, sweatshirt, alright. Anything at all? Bed? A real bed. <laughs> Can't believe I'm that happy to stay at a motel. Okay, fresh towels. Ooh la la. Fresh clean towels. Alright. What was that all about? Okay. Uh, he's so happy about fresh towels, boys. It's it's a normal thing in the in our normal life. I don't know. Right, let's take the phone, I guess. No, why don't you unplug it? It's not even charged. What are you doing? Or whatever. Who's he texting to? Lila? Alright. Oh, shit. Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this? Yeah, you should. She'll get into trouble too. Not only she'd get in trouble, but also you, sh you, they'll know where you are because they'll find Lila and they'll ask her where we are. Don't call Lila. Absolutely not. Throw the goddamn phone already. You don't need it. It's going to cause you trouble. They're going to they're gonna know where to track you. This guy, man. Absolutely the worst fugitive ever. Throw the phone. There we go. I've got the options. I'm gonna do it. Let's got them. Throw the phone. You don't need it anymore. No more phones, boys. We're much safer without it. We should probably go see if Daniel's fine. Oh, he's actually fine. All right. Don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. There we go. Let's tell him. Bring him down to earth a little bit. He'll feel like he'll feel really sad about it right now, but in a couple of days he'll be uh, talk directly. Man, I I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. I gotta to do something Daniel, serious. Uh, come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? You can't. I'm thirsty. All right. right. Now. You said I could have a coke. Or something. Okay. I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal? The big deal is a big deal, my guy. You already know. All right, a soda. So we gotta get uh, from this side right here. Hopefully nothing happens. I swear something's gonna happen just because I just got out of my room. Buy a soda for $2. Wasting my money on that. Goddamn Daniel. Let's give him a goddamn can already.
Daniel. What? Oh, he's having a nightmare again? How is he sleeping? Oh, fuck. What the hell? Oh my god. Daniel! What the fuck's going on? Daniel, calm down! You lied! What the? Oh, yeah, okay, so he saw it. Calm down, what was it? I can't remember. Calm. Calm down. Calm down, Daniel. Let's just talk, please. You knew Dad was dead. You knew it. What the? Why? Why did you lie to me? I didn't lie to you. I wanted to protect you. I just wanted to protect you until I could... Protect me from what? From the fucking cops! I... I hate you! You're not my brother! <laughs> chill out! Daniel, chill out, okay? Get away from me! Shh, shh, shh. I hate you! Shh. You better chill out, my guy. Watch me! Daniel, please! God damn. It's okay. <laughs> Fucking chill out, Daniel. Well, he did, he did see, at least he knows. Wanted to tell him myself. Now I wanted it to go, I guess, but it is what it is. He knows, at least. You told me we were gonna see Dad. I'm sorry. I just... Well, don't lie to me ever again. Ever. Alright, I'll try. I'll try, Daniel. But I can't make any promises. I need to protect you now. At any cost. I don't care. I'm not a baby. You don't need to protect me. Yes, I do. It's just you and me now. And I won't fail you. What are we gonna do without him? Shh. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Am I a monster? Nothing is wrong with you. You're different. Okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos where Dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. <laughs> he used to tell me bedtime stories, too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together. But, but one day, hunters took their dad away. Now the brothers were alone, and they had to find a new home. They started a journey through the great thick.
be continued boys here we go finished it finish the first episode uh, that was gonna be a previous like uh, is there, are they gonna show us some sort of pre stuff from the second episode or something let's leave they are no they are not uh, well first it's the stats alright so get the shadow crypts for yourself so most of the people did that uh, I lied to Esteban so most of the people told the truth that's uh, that's interesting I asked Esteban alright uh, you didn't take the money from the jar so that's good most of the people did it uh, didn't so that's good confronted Brett that's good as well uh, you didn't steal in the parking lot hmm that's interesting uh, you didn't beg for food that's good um, you stole with uh, while Daniel distracted Doris all right I'm really part of the most minority there okay uh, you hit Hank and stole the camping gear all right so most of the people did that though uh, you called Lila back you didn't call back so I'm part of the minority I actually didn't didn't call back I wonder what happens to those who call back because it's probably gonna be bad for them I'm part of the really big minority who said you'll try to be honest yeah I like most of people like to promise things do promises I never do any promises never do any promises in life boys because if you can't fulfill them then it is, it's on your ass so don't make promises you can't keep you know it's just like that uh, Daniel learned about trailblazing Daniel didn't fall in the fo woods uh, built a fort all right we're good we don't need to didn't get mad all right all right that's cool I got all these good things so for the most part I am part of the my, my majority which it's interesting uh, most of, in most of these games, I'm always part of minority. In this time, focus. They're pretty great. Okay. Trust me. You can do it. That's what I'm talking about right here, boys. I'm excited to see the episode two already. Uh, we're gonna. It looks like we're gonna start training uh, Daniel to get control of his powers and stuff. Know how to use them properly. That's gonna be awesome. Let's go back to the main menu. I hope you guys enjoyed this first episode. And in total, I'm gonna see you guys for the next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Keep it easy, boys.